For those of you who don't know, Michael has two older brothers, and I have the pleasure of being one of them. When Mike and Jackie asked me to marry them, I was obviously very honored, but reminded them quickly that I'm not actually ordained. And with a smile, Jackie said, actually, you are. She had taken my information and gotten me ordained without me knowing. <laughs> I suddenly felt very spiritual. <laughs> like most people these days, Mike and Jackie met on a dating app. After they matched, Mike had just 24 hours for Jackie to contact him before the match would expire. Michael, sweating, without Jackie contacting him, took advantage of the option to pay an extra $10 <laughs> to extend the match. It's a small price to pay for love, okay? <laughs> it worked out, and we're here today. Some might call that desperate, I call it fate. <laughs> After their first date, Michael told his friend Alex, I'm going to marry her. And Alex replied, that's weird. <laughs> Do not tell anybody that. <laughs> Jacqueline said that same first date ended with her going in for a kiss and Michael completely dodging her. <laughs> so she got in her Uber and thought she would never see him again. I'm left wondering how Michael thought he was going to marry her if he couldn't even kiss her. <laughs> pleasure of watching their love for each other grow and blossom into what it is today. We've gathered this evening to celebrate love, commitment, friendship, family, and these two who are in it forever. So as individuals, we have thousands of important moments that happen throughout our lives. But this one is regarded as one so critical, we acknowledge its special status by sharing it with others. You don't have to have a ceremony to have a marriage. So why do we do it? Because despite all of our differences, love is what we all share. It is the great unifier, our one universal truth, that no matter who we are, where we've come from, what we believe, we know this one thing, love is what we're doing right. That's why we're both standing here. And that's why all of you are here to watch them stand. Here. We have all loved in our lifetimes, and in this moment we're reminded that the ability to love is the very best part of our humanity. Michael and Jacqueline, we're here to support you, be proud of you, and to remind you that marriage isn't just happily ever after. It is the experience of writing your story together.
when I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I promise to love and honor you. I promise to love and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. <laughs> no. <laughs> Michael, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I promise to love and honor you all the days of my life. I promise to love and honor you all the days of my life. With this ring, I be wed. With this ring, I be wed. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Michael, you can kiss your brother. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Michael Scott Bruno. Yeah.